Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. In this video, we are going to look at the Lewis structure of N2O4 molecule. It's a chemical formula of dinitrogen tetroxide. And to determine its Lewis structure, we will count the total number of valence electrons. We have two nitrogen atom having five valence electrons and four oxygen atom having six valence electrons. And that gives us a total of 34 valence electrons. Let us see the arrangement of atoms. For that, we will place nitrogen atom adjacent to each other and then we will attach two oxygen atoms to each nitrogen atom. Then we will place electron pair in between each atom for bond formation. Now each oxygen atom needs six more electrons for complete octet and so let us go ahead and assign six electrons to each oxygen atom. Well, this way we have used all the valence electrons, but nitrogen here still needs two more electrons for complete octet. And so to avoid that, what we will do is we will shift two electrons from this oxygen atoms here to in between nitrogen and oxygen atoms. That will result in formation of double bond. And but this way nitrogen, both the nitrogen atoms will complete their octet. So let us calculate the formal charge of each atom just to confirm that this is the best possible Lewis structure. For oxygen, we have 6 valence electrons minus 6 non-bonding electrons minus 2 bonding electrons divided by 2. That will give us a formal charge of minus 1. For this oxygen, we have 6 valence electrons minus 4 non-bonding electrons minus 2 bonding electrons divided by 2. That will give us a formal charge of 0. For nitrogen, we have 5 valence electrons minus 0 non-bonding electrons minus 8 bonding electrons divided by 2. That will give us a formal charge of plus 1. Well, we always try to make the formal charges zero on every atom so as to minimize the charge distribution and increase stability. But sometimes it is not possible to do so. So what we do is we instead try to minimize the charges like we did in this case. Also, you can shift electrons from any of the oxygen atom to fulfill the octet of nitrogen atom and that won't make any difference. Such structures that have different arrangement of electrons but the connectivity of atoms the same are known as resonance structures as shown here. For more such videos make sure to subscribe our channel and thank you for watching.